um, Hurricane Lana, made landfall as a category one hurricane with winds of 75 miles per hour, um, just between the Dangriga and Placentia. And it had at the time a minimum central pressure of 995 millibars. Between quarter to 12 and um, half hour, probably after midnight, in terms of winds in Dangriga, there was an average of around 37 miles per hour with gusts up to 52 miles per hour between, um, around 12, 30, 11, sorry, 11.35 last night. Um, in Placencia, the average sustained winds was around 25 miles per hour with um, gusts up to up to 49 miles per hour around the time of landfall. But the storm may land far between those two areas, and so that is where the maximum winds of 75 miles per hour was recorded. And also, with, just before the storm may land fall, the station that is managed by the Smithsonian um, Institute recorded the 75 mile per hour winds in gusts around 9 a.m. I'm not, sorry, 9 p.m. to midnight. So that was just before the land, when the storm strengthened into a category one hurricane and um, shortly before landfall. And then it continued to move um, westward across the country between midnight and early this morning. And now it is um, to the west of us. Did it downgrade to a tropical storm shortly after it made landfall? Yeah, in the 3 a.m., if I'm not mistaken, advisory had it as a tropical storm. So this morning, it was still a tropical storm at 6 a.m. when it was over northern Guatemala. Based on the rainfall data, it would seem as if between the Placencia and the Bella Vista area, along the um, southern coast, they were the ones most impacted with rainfall. Oh, and also um, in Punta Gorda, near the airstrip, they had rainfall between two inches to um, 3.5 inches. In terms of the wind speed, the Dangriga area of the two received the higher um, winds with around Gusts of around 52 miles per hour and a sustained wind of 37 miles per hour. While in Placencia, the sustained winds was around 25 miles per hour and the maximum winds were around um, 49 miles per hour in the Placencia area. Those are unofficial um, results we need to verify. Um, and validate the data from our automatic and also on our from our manual stations in those locations, but unofficially those are what our automatic stations are reporting at this time.